Hi everyone. Welcome back. You're watching Kiss My Crafts. I don't want to sit. I want to stand. <laughs> You're watching Kiss My Crafts. My name's Maritza. If this is your first time here, welcome. If you are a regular, welcome back. Anyway, I have some exciting things to go over with you today. Um, the first thing I want to go over is a finish I did my little tiny 20 by 20 and I'm done with it and I'm love the way it came out Oops. the beautiful eye by diamond art club it's art by Patrice Murciano this little guy had 32 colors <laughs> you see 32 lots of confetti here but since it was it's so small I did all of one color at one time so and the white that was fun because I used my nine placer that was the first time I used a nine placer on a square I tried before and I didn't like the way it came out um, but I've been using the nine placer on my rounds so often and my three placers that I guess I got um, better at it and they're not the straightest however I'm I'm happy with it it's fine now I did do because I usually do checkerboard on squares when it's a large block of color but um, here I did um, the nine placer and then somewhere over here which I can't even tell I did um, checkerboard and to me they don't look any different so this here was check I'm um, not checkerboard this was a nine placer um, and I believe right here was checkerboard so I don't really see a difference so nine placer it is even though the checkerboard sometimes it's fun because you do different I do different patterns um, and it goes faster but that Placing drills one by one, especially in a large block of color, uh, it just, to me, it drags. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I highly recommend practicing with those multi-placers because it does make everything go faster. I mean, I did this in this bottom part in no time. And it, it wasn't even a drag for me using the same color. Because sometimes I get tired of the same color. Um, but I did half first, and then I did the other half. For the first time ever... I have to say this the first time ever I had absolutely no garbage none zilch ninguno no garbage now I didn't use all the drills there were plenty of drills left over for all the colors um, I dropped the 5200s <laughs> um, but I still had another bag so it was no problem um, yeah, I had no garbage. None. I was so surprised. I'm sure there's one or two in there, but I didn't come across any. Even when I poured them into the little containers, um, I already re-kitted the next project that I'm doing. I mean, re-kitted. I kitted down this project and kitted up the next project. So I'm not sure where I put the drills. I wanted to show you how many I had left over. Um, oh, I see them. Hold on. This is how I stored them. Um, I like to keep the deck separate. So I had every color, every single color had leftovers. So they gave me more than enough. Of course, the canvas was a pleasure to work with. It's DAC. Everybody knows. Well, most everybody knows how wonderful these canvases are to work with. Okay. With that being said, let's get on to the next thing. I asked you to pick my next project and you did and it was almost unanimous one person picked B everyone else picked A um, Patty I'm going to put the fortune tree high on my queue just for you thank you for responding and thank you to all the other ones that did respond um, I appreciate each and every one of your comments 
Um, so now that we know which one I'm doing, let me show her. I'm excited. I cheated a little bit. I already started her, but just a very little portion of the bottom. Um, I'm a lefty. I start at the bottom left, so that's how comfortable. That's my comfortable way of starting. Um, I'll like work all the way across, and then I'll go as high as I could comfortably, and then I'll turn it <laughs> and work from the side. Um, once I do both sides, then I work from bottom, from this way, um, from top to bottom, or backwards, or upside down, upside down, more to say. So, I'm excited. I've already put some, like I said, some drills down. So, I'm excited to work on her because she's absolutely gorgeous. Um, thank you for all that participated. I really, really appreciate it. And it was fun. Um... I'll probably do it again. I do have something working in the future um, with two other young ladies in a group. I'm not going to say all the specifics yet, um, but that's something that's going to be coming next month, um, the three of us. I do have to talk to them first to make sure that they're okay with this being placed on YouTube. Um, one of them does have a YouTube channel, so when the time comes, I will um, link her. And I'm not sure about the other young lady. Um, I have to check to see if she has a channel. Um, so when all the, all the specifics are done, then, um, I'll let you know more information on that. Um, but that's something that's coming next month. Anyway, yeah, cause I can't keep doing unboxings and whipping chats all the time, right? I gotta change it up a little bit, keep you interested. Um, okay, so... This will be my next project. I will do some whipping chats and some updates on it. Um, and um, I'm excited. I'm excited. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for all those that participated. Okay. Now, the most exciting. I have reached a little bit of a milestone. Well, for me, it's a gigantic milestone because I didn't even think I would make it this far. Um, I have surpassed 100 subscribers. This video I've been meaning to do all week. I even started making, I didn't make one, but I hated the way it came out. So um, here I am making another one. Anyway, I saw that I reached 100 subscribers. My 100th subscriber is someone named Wintry Kiss. Thank you um, for being my 100th. So I'm past 100 already, so this video is way overdue. So, in honor of 100 subscribers, well, first, I just want to thank all those that subscribed, thank all those that like my videos, that comment on my videos, um, the, those that have pushed me into starting this YouTube channel, Diamond Art Addiction, Sherry from Diamond Art Addiction. She, she was, first of all, she was inspiration because um, I had been wanting to start this um, channel for a long time. Um, but when I first saw Sh Cherry on her videos, she was very new. Um, I think she might have had three videos out and I really enjoyed watching her and, you know, I let her know. And I also told her that I've been wanting to start a channel. And she gave me the little push and the inspiration to start it. So I want to thank her first of all. And um, all those others that have commented and have messaged me and told me I'm doing well and that they enjoy my videos. Um, thank you. Thank you, guys. I really appreciate it. I really didn't think I was going to make it to 100 subscribers. No. Um, I, I just did this. It's, it's something that I was always interested in doing and without any high expectations, but, um, it's, it's, it's a nice little goal to reach and I'm really proud and I'm happy. And I think I, I wouldn't have done it if it wasn't for you guys. Cause I really don't do anything but to put the videos out. It's you guys that helped me get to this um, point and, you know, thank you. Um, I wanted to name a lot of people, but right now my name, my mind is blank 
there's something about the moon and my sign that it's an emotional time for me. <laughs> so um, someone at work told me, Jalea, your mom told me that. Um, someone at work told me something about, because she's also a Capricorn, so something about our signs and the moon and em being emotional during this time. Um, I don't know if the time has passed, but I'm still feeling it. So um, I don't want to name names and then leave someone out. Um, so you all know who you are. And um, again, thank you. So, and that with that being said, I'm going to do a giveaway. Now, um, right now, it's not the best of time for me. I'm going through a lot of shit. And um, so, but I still want to give back. So I am not going to buy something brand new from you know a store and have it sent to the winner directly i can't do that right now so i am going to give part with something from my stash now i thought long and hard um because i have a lot i can part with something it's not a problem for me it was just choosing which one and why i chose this one so um everyone knows diamond art club and i have quite a few of them I could part with one of those and that would be really special for someone however um, I wanted to give something from a company that I heard from actually Cherry again from Diamond Art Addiction she had do, done an unboxings of um, from this company called Treasure Studios Arts and what she ordered was really beautiful and it wasn't um, pictures I've seen anywhere else so I went to the website and I looked at all their stuff and it was so hard to choose because they do have unique paintings they license these artists um, so the artists get commission from what they you know what is sold and um, it's it, it was a pleasure to deal with them I uh, messaged um, the young lady from the company named Rachel and uh, through email a couple of questions or she had questions for me I don't remember but I know we interchanged emails and she was a, a pleasure very nice and um, when I got the canvases I bought two so um, I ordered two it was very hard to choose because they do have a nice selection I will link them down below um, so I can part with one so someone else can experience the quality that is this canvas and um, the customer service from this company. Um, so I decided, since I already have something similar, I decided to part with this one. Uh, I wanna get it turned around right, and it's absolutely gorgeous. It's a gold finch surrounded by beautiful pink flowers. It has 30 colors. Um, the drill field, I did an unboxing of this, but I'll go over it again. The drill field is gorgeous. So where we get this, it's also shiny. And the drill, this has the clear cover. Um, I'm not going to lift it up because I don't want to do anything to the glue because whoever gets this, I want this to be in pristine condition, just as how I got it. Uh, the drill, where are the drills? So, you're going to get this, whoever wins, and the drills are already in baggies, so you can just open the box and um, start diamond painting. Look how beautiful those colors are, very beautiful. So yeah, the winner is going to get this, and um, all you have to do to have an entry in this giveaway is of course be a subscriber and comment down below what brought you to my channel answer that question how did you find out about me whether it was it came up on your uh, recommended or suggested videos whether someone told you about me uh, you saw me in a group my link um, on a live however you found me let me know how you found me i'm interested in knowing how people um have come across my channel anyway thank you to all that have subscribed 
to those that have commented. Oh, those that have commented, um, you get a bonus entry. Um, all of you will get a bonus entry. You know who you are. Those of you that have commented on past videos, that is. Um, so you know who you are. I can name some offhand. Um, Jalia, Nareda, Naomi, Kendra. Oh my goodness, I don't want to leave people out. Becky from Becky's Diamond Madness. Madness for Diamonds. Um, I'll link her down below. Um, Sherry from Diamond Art Addiction. Oh my goodness, Tracy from Tracy's DPs. Mindy. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Patty Rivas. Um, oh my goodness, I, I, I know I'm leaving a lot of people out. And I'm sorry, but... I, Making these videos, I get a little nervous. I feel like I have an audience, so um, I get like, mm, I get so, so fucking nervous. <laughs> anyway, um, thank you again. So leave a comment down below. I don't know when I'm gonna end this. It's probably a week. You know, I will. I have um, another video that I have to upload that I recorded a while ago. It's an unboxing. Of the last kit that I received from AliExpress um, and I received it when I was vacation that's how long ago but I did the video a couple of weeks ago I need to upload that but I'll give this about a week um, and then I'll announce the winner I'm not sure how I'm gonna pick the winner I might write names I don't you know expect a lot of comments I don't you know hundreds of comments where I can't write the names it's it, it I'm old-fashioned old-school so I might write the names and pick them out of an actual hat or I might go check out one of those random pickers that people use I've never looked at that I've never used it so I have to figure it out I'm sure it's easy um, so I'll let you guys know I'll fill you in I'll probably do a whip and chat later on today um, and work on my next project so um, good luck and thank you again, everyone. Um, you guys be blessed. Uh, may you always have peace in your life, in your heart. Um, and God bless. I'm not the most religious person, but right now I'm feeling a little spiritual, a little emotional. So, yeah, I wish you all peace. I wish you all happiness. I wish you all lots and lots of love. Um, thank you, mi gente. Hasta luego. Until next time. Besos. Mwah.